Ford had a hit on their hands when they reintroduced the 5 liter in dual overhead cam form. 412 horsepower from the factory and responds awesome to boost. Throw a supercharger on it and it'll make 200 more horsepower without even blinking an eye. That's what we're talking about today. Edelbrock's new crate engine package, which takes a Ford Racing Illuminator long block, strap an E4 supercharger on it, and you get 700 horsepower with a two year warranty. Behind us, we have our 700 horse Coyote supercharged crate engine. It starts out as a Ford Racing Illuminator supercharged long block. It's basically a low compression 9.5 to 1, fully forged internals that's just ready for boost. When coupled with the Edelbrock E4 supercharger, it can add up to 300 more horsepower over top of what the normal Coyote already produces. The supercharger is based off of the Eaton TVS 2300 rotor group. It's a little bit of a unique design because it's actually inverted. Also with the inverted supercharger design, keeps the blower up off the valley of the motor, keeping it a little bit cooler and allows for a larger intercooler. Well, you can see that the engine right now is in an S197 Mustang, which is not what would normally come with a Coyote. We're using this as our test mule for calibration. So after we've done all of our engine dyno calibration, we have to put it in a vehicle and do all of our drivability calibration. And the 4 cam motor is already a big engine as is, so putting it into an engine bay, as long as it fits, it's a real popular design. It's really easy to hook up in general. It's a very self-contained motor. Put the controls pack to it, wire up a couple of external wires, and it fires up with the calibration Edelbrock put into the PCM already. Edelbrock's engine package packs 615.4 horsepower and 583 pound-feet of torque to the rear wheels. This is achieved through 12 pounds of boost and a conservative 11.3 to 1 air-fuel ratio. Edelbrock spent a lot of time on this tune. It's a very safe tune, you can drive it hard every day. They do that because they want to make sure the engine warranty that they supply with the engine sticks. You know, driving Edelbrock's 2008 Mustang, it just drives like a 463 valve going down the street. That is until you downshift and get on it. Then you'll realize it's not a 463 valve. It's a 700 horsepower Coyote backed by an Edelbrock supercharger. Edelbrock even said that they got 23, 24 miles per gallon driving it on the freeway to a trip. That's on par for what a stock 2011 Mustang gets right out of the factory.